the question is that, and this is very important question, uh, somewhere you are not confident in your life, right? And I strongly believe being confident is the greatest asset you can have in your life, right? But the question is that how to build your self-confidence. So the question goes to Shashank and he is going to express his views about this particular topic, how to build your self-confidence. Good evening, everyone. My name is Shashank Khumnani, and my topic is how one can improve their self-confidence. So here I express my views. So basically, how can one improve their self-confidence? First of all, the one person should have clarity in every manner, like whatever thoughts or whatever thing he see or whatever the surroundings he live or what is, whatever the products he has used or he has see whatever thing. So he must have the clarity about things, clarity about that things. Like one should have to first see that in which thing he is good or she is good. Like some may be good in cooking, some may be good in singing, some may be good in like dancing. So we should first go inside ourselves and see in which things we are good and in which things we are best. Then we have to work on that things. Like when we go starting doing work on that things, so we should make our thoughts clarity. Like there should be a clarity of thoughts in that. Like we should not get confused if somebody asks you that what you want to do in life. So we should know about that things that also help us to build our self-confidence. Secondly, we start have to say no. How I telling about that, what we, why have we have to say no? Because we have our friends, our relatives, or many things that like put us into our responsibility. So sometimes because of the sake of the goal, we have to say no to our friends because sometimes they will force you to come outside for just five minutes. But just because five minutes they will that gonna waste your half an hour regarding to your goal. So you have to build confidence to say no because once you will say goal, it will like benefit in your future. And many think that it will gonna hurt their friends or like what can we say affect their relationship. So I think it not will go that like, like that because if we say no and if our friend or relative or anyone who are attached to us if he is in positive in nature if he's build our positive relationship with us so he will gonna understand why he's telling no and what he's trying to communicate with us so this is also help to build us this self-confidence and third thing sorry third thing third things that we have to focus is that start working on yourself start telling yourself that you are the best once you will create yourself when you create your character in your own mind that you are the best that will help to be boost your confidence and fourth thing is that start doing that things in which you feel scared like go that thing try to do that thing like good but if you get if you converted that self-confidence into overconfidence or you take that self-confidence to egoistic so that will cause you the greatest problem in your life because many of us having self-confidence because having self-confidence but sometimes we get overconfidence and that cause to the many problems like sometimes we feel like sometimes we're gonna hurt with our words be polite be gentle if you're self-confident yeah express your views express your opinions that's good but be polite be humble to everyone don't show that you are good in something and don't try to like that you are apart from him or apart from her like that thank you such sir such a great performance have a clear